Hi, welcome. I'm Sophia at Palmetto Ford. This segment today is going to teach you ladies it's not the end of the world if you get a flat tire. Today, Vivi's going to demonstrate how to change a tire on a Ford Explorer. So you're on the side of the road and you're stuck because you have a flat tire and you just realize you don't have roadside assistance. That's okay because in this video, you're going to learn how to do it. First, it's important to be familiar with your vehicle to know where you keep these necessary items. Lift the lining in the trunk to get the spare tire and the jack. Then remove the wing nut to release the tire, moving it counterclockwise. Remove the tire. Underneath the tire is your jack kit. You must now unscrew the fastener. Remove the jack and loosen the jack handle by turning the end of the jack counterclockwise. Now you can attach the handle to the jack by locating the lug nut wrench. If you have a hub cap, you'll remove it with the end of the wrench. Now, use the wrench to loosen the lug nuts. Do not remove them completely. You may have to stand on the wrench to loosen them. You will not be removing them completely until the tire is lifted off the ground. Now use your manual to locate the jack points of the Explorer or whatever vehicle you'll be using. Position the jack underneath the identified jack point and connect the handle to the jack. Begin turning the handle clockwise to engage the jack and lift the tire. Raise the vehicle and make sure the wheel is completely off the ground. Remove the lug nuts completely by turning them counterclockwise and place them somewhere safe, either your pocket or a purse. Remove the flat tire and place the spare on the axle. Now tighten the lug nuts before lowering the vehicle. You will first hand tighten them and use the wrench. Now you're ready to lower the vehicle. Once it's on the ground, re-tighten the lug nuts in a star pattern. Then put the jack kit back in its place. Don't forget to place the flat tire on top. Keep in mind that spare tires are not safe to drive in high speeds or for more than a couple of days. So now that you have that spare tire on, Make sure you drive to Palmetto Ford to get the new tire replacement. It is not safe to drive in that spare tire for more than a couple days or in high speeds. We look forward to seeing you here. Thank you.